What's up everybody? This is Dave here from DroidInsider.com. This is a review of the Viper ICS ROM. This is Viper ROM IC 3D Beta 3D. I'm sorry, Beta 3. Um, some cool things going on with this ROM where they got quite a bit working. Um, of course you have your camera that does work in 3D. So you got 3D on here. I don't know how well that looks on the camera, of course, but uh, 3D camera does work. Uh, the effects, the only thing I noticed missing out of here was HDR and panoramic, but uh, very good camera. Um, your pull down menu here. You got your uh, recently used apps up at <coughs> Excuse me, up at the top, so you can hit that button and make them go away. Your quick settings here, it's got Leadroid tweaks at the top, you got all your on and off switches and then adjustments over here, um, so you can turn your flashlight on. I like the uh, changing of the colors and high graphics here. Um, obviously include to save power, silent mode, vibration, Let's get to the task manager. Um, Kill everything off here. Uh, we're looking about 382 uh, used, 415 free. So, good amount of RAM to multitask there. Go ahead and start off with a Lin pack here. Um, I noticed right when I installed the ROM, I was getting half the score as I am now. Um, it didn't quite take a reboot, but. Uh, it is a little bit, maybe just more time needed for other processes to finish it. So anyways, I'm getting like mid-50s and mid-60s. Uh, pretty good score. And I had started a quadrant, but I hadn't finished it. And it stopped. Let's try that again. Find the full benchmark. So it's going to take a minute, but... Um, the ice cream sandwich version of Viper ROM runs very smooth. Um, quite a few of the bugs are out of the um, system. Uh, they constantly are updating and as like I said, beta 3. So they've worked out a couple of the kinks there. Um, there's a couple of features I'll show you that uh, I guess are ice cream sandwich of course me having the 3D only I'm, I'm not too used to ice cream sandwich other than installing it a couple times before so uh, I'll show you a couple of the ones I had found um, the apps move uh, not paginated uh, it's not page by page you can scroll from the top to the bottom of all the apps uh, straight through um, they go up and down. I know some of the ice cream sandwich goes left and right. Uh, the apps here go up and down. Uh, it's got plenty of tweaks on here, which I'll get to show you that. And uh, see how this quadrant score goes. I've noticed from all the quadrants I've run, uh, the second time I run it, I pretty much just add two to four hundred on the quadrant score for my first run, and that's when we get my second run. Uh, so. This first, first quadrant run, for whatever reason, always seems to be the slowest score I'm going to get any time I run it. Almost done here. Last test. Alright, the device scored around 2167, so you bet you can get about 2324 out of the uh, app itself. If you hold down the home key, you'll see all your recent applications here. Uh, you can swipe them over just to get uh, them out of the way. Um, anything that you've used before. And uh, if you want to go back to them, you just click on them. So. Um, it moves really smooth. I don't have a whole bunch of fun on these other pages, so it's kind of hard to tell. But yeah, there's it all moves really smooth. The all apps I told you it's it goes straight through it. Uh, we got a log cat. 
Uh, let's see what else we got here. We got the Dropbox, uh, Facebook Flashlight, Flash Player, Google Plus, Goo Manager. I looked that one up. Uh, Goo Manager seems to be for uh, being able to download and basically connect all the uh, devs' files and, and so forth to be able to download other ROMs and even update this one or check for updates. You got your Leadroid tweaks there, <coughs> which I'll get into that. Um, I did, by the way, install Dolphin Browser on here, so that didn't come with it. Um, Metamorph, that allows you, I guess, to install other themes on this phone. Let's see what else we got here. Install Quadrant. Came with Root Browser. And Titanium Backup and Terminal Emulator, which Terminal Emulator, you can go on that and type SU for Super User, give it access, then type in VC, and that's uh, Viper Controls. Um, so you can actually overclock or whatnot. This kernel I'm using right now does not allow overclocking. Uh, you got your Vi Viper ROM updater. Uh, check for updates there. Um, I tried the Wi-Fi tether and the Wi-Fi hotspot, and neither of them worked for me. Um, I tried turning the, the routing fix on and such, but it, it wasn't working for me. So, uh, let's see, get into these Lee Droid tweaks, which most average, I mean, they're on ice cream sandwich, so a little bit different. You've got your status bars, your HTC Sense, your lock screens. This lock screen does offer, uh, which just reminded me, the security does offer face unlock. And it does work on here. So if you've been dying to try that face unlock and you haven't had a ROM to it yet, this does do the face unlock. And I hadn't looked at the wallpapers. I don't know if there's some. Yeah, they got some custom. Looks like 21 different ROM uh, wallpapers here. So uh, a couple you've seen before, a couple you haven't. Uh, so good number. Uh, ROM or uh, wallpapers there. So I uh, don't know if I'm leaving something out, but let me know what you guys think. Oh, I'll go ahead and show you the battery life on this thing real quick. Before I was always in my car and battery power issues, battery use wasn't an issue. <clears throat> right now I got nearly five hours and I burned up 30% uh, of my battery. That's actually not too bad because I have been using my phone fairly hever, heavily. So a little bit moderate to heavy use. And uh, I've just burned up 31% well, of my battery. So pretty good. Um, so definitely check it out, guys. Let me know what you think. Uh, any suggestions? Uh, anything I left out? Um, let me know if you guys want to see another ROM that uh, I haven't done recently. Uh, don't forget to subscribe. It really helps. And it helps if I get that thumbs up. So thank you all. Talk to you then.